so I have a different type of video today. Um, it's on the subject of any news or debate or just current event. It has more to do with reflection. Um, you know, everyone's life at some point changes in some way. And, you know, that's it has to do with status quo while it may exist in fiction as a, you know, state of just being permanent, you're not going to see that in real life because we can't control time moving forward. Um, and because we can't control that and because I know this and also think about it re relatively regularly, I oftentimes don't allow things that I want to see done just gets uh, ignored because I, I believe firmly in using every ounce of time available to me for something good. I think this is something productive. It might help somebody. Um, and there are people in this world who, you know, I, I feel take time for granted. I know when I was a child, um, I certainly felt that way because things didn't really seem to change each year. You were still, you know, in your early years. And so you just had this state of affairs that stayed relatively the same for years and years until one day you wake up and, oh, things are different. This new bombshell, this new, um, you know, surprise. That's not to say every change we have in life is going to, you know, completely shake us up, but there will be things that change our lives, you know, since the death of a loved one or uh, moving somewhere else that will make you completely be surprised by what, you know, this new situation is. But in reacting to that situation, you have to determine whether or not you're going to allow it. Send the video notification um, from Team Four Star. You know, I, I get notifications on my channel. That's not important. So, and it's coming up on there too. You turn the volume on that down as well. Um, you know, you have to take life and allow every moment to count. And I, I really try and go out of my way to not let any, you know, free amount of time be wasted. You know, if I'm uh, eating something, I'll try to write something as well. Um, if I'm sitting in a class, say, and, you know, I'm just bored, I guess, I'll try to write something in there too. There's just so many different things that I use my time for, um, you know, because I know that I'll never have... I'll give me an example. Today is... September 8th, 2016. It will never be that day again. It will never be 316 again. And sure enough, that minute's about to pass us right now. What we do with our time is something that really can never be taken away from us. I mean, it just passed. But also, we need to use it effectively, um, you know, and productively. So there's always that call for people to go to school and to, you know, fin graduate on time. And that's because, as I've seen with, um, you know, several of my classes since uh, leaving high school, uh, you know, there are older people in there and they seem to have either a sense of regret or have wakened up or woken up, rather. My you know, English isn't that great uh, to the reality that time has passed. They need this stuff to, you know, make it here in this you know 21st century. And they're not going to allow any more time to pass. And, there, you know, there's nothing wrong with realizing uh you know the, the situation we have now where you need schooling to get any type of job that uh, i guess pays at a rate that most people would find livable or doable as you know many people are dissatisfied with the minimum wage but the point is you always have to let things play out um and letting things play out oftentimes includes your involvement. You know, I wrote uh, three books over the course of last, um, let's say last year, feels like last year, earlier this year, and kind of at the end of last year too, sort of. And in doing that, you know, I just said I wasn't going to allow much more time to pass without doing something productive. And I feel as if that was, you know, something that worked to an extent, but I don't feel a need to do it anymore. 
but nonetheless it still was something that did not I did not feel was a waste of time and for that reason I'm grateful for being able to do that but you have to find what stuff you like and try to uh, you know move things along I, I really you know I don't, I don't play the game of I'll get to it next week or week after that week after that I, I want something done I go out and do it and I'm never going to change that type of thinking as far as myself and you know how life goes by every single minute but yeah thank you for watching and have a good day and remember life is gone at the spin of a wheel peace